To discover real Siberia and become its ambassadors, the goal of the first group taking part in the follow-up Siberia program, organized by Russian firm Nor Nickel. Seven travelers chosen from different countries flew to Norilsk. Their first impressions were overwhelming. I am from Serbia and this is Siberia. It's really winter, it's cold and uh, those reindeers, oh my God, it's beautiful. It's first time for me to see this live. Travelers saw the legendary Subkaga mammoth, which died 48,000 years ago, and learned about the Putarana Nature Reserve. It's on the UNESCO World Heritage List. I like unique, one-of-a-kind places, and for me, Siberia is like the holy grail of unique. My goal here is to dispel some of the stereotypes that are existing right now about Siberia, that it's cold, it's vast, there's nothing to do, and I want to show people that there is actually a lot to do here. I didn't realize that uh, Norilsk, for example, is such a big place. <laughs> The travelers had a chance to see one of its landmarks, the historic Nor Nikel Bear Creek open pit of Zapolani Mine. 420 meters deep with a total road length of around 30 kilometers, while underground work spread for 41 kilometers. The uniqueness of this pit lies in the fact that the firm has been developing reserves of copper nickel ores here since 1945. Next stop is the Nor Nickel copper plant built beyond the Arctic Circle in 1949. Here our travelers learned more about the history of the city which basically grew around metallurgy. Nor Nickel is 15 years older than Narilsk. It's for sure a rare chance to get here so I'm excited. We really got close to the uh, process itself to see, see the melting and also I liked it. In Dudinka, a hundred kilometers from Norilsk, our adventurers were special guests at the WCT Arctic Curling Cup. First watching the world's best competitors in action, then having a curling lesson from 15-year-old local sportsman Vinyamin Bezrukiha. He studies at Dudinka's curling school and got great results in the junior competition organized during the cup. Curling can be compared to chess, but tenacity is the main thing. The next day, our visitors returned to the world's northernmost arena to battle it out against the Arctic Cup media team. Milos and Vikram won the silver medal. First time I played curling over here. In India, it's not a very common thing because we don't have any snow and ice. I enjoyed the curling and it's wonderful. And they went through a special Taimir initiation ceremony based on the legends and history of the people who inhabited this peninsula throughout the centuries. It's really nice. I have a feeling that I am in some centuries, centuries ago. These travelers will go back home to become ambassadors for Siberia ahead of the 29th Winter Universiad for student athletes next year in Krasnoyarsk. Siberia is very far away and very, very beautiful. It is the most beautiful place I have ever seen in my life. It's very energetic, the people are very friendly and it's, it's blooming. I really like this place. 